Posh Vlog of the family, welcome back to the channel and on today's video I'm still here in the Philippines and we're about to go to Green Hills with my cousin Hi. <laughs> and we're gonna go check out if we'll be able to get the newest Mickey Mouse Go Philippines so tada! Before we head out to Green Hills, let's go around Manila for a little bit Our first stop is Luneta Park or also known as Rizal Park, an iconic park here in the Philippines where you could find the monument of our national hero, Jose Rizal. Fun fact, Jose Rizal's monument is guarded continuously by the Philippine Marine Corps Security Guard. And throughout the day, the guards will switch places and take their breaks. And we're gonna grab some dirty ice cream. Nope, it's not dirty, but that's how we call it. And yes, Freddy had to go on a trip with me and I take him everywhere I go. We are finally here at Green Hills and I am excited to grab those Mickey Funko Pops. And we are here at Big Boy's Toy Store and this is the only place where you can get the full set of Mickey with the Chase variant. And we're back here at the Pop Shibaku headquarters you guys and I have to say Pivi had an awesome time in the Philippines and it was such a cool coincidence that while Pivity was there in the Philippines, she was able to go ahead and snag a new release of an awesome character, Mickey the Mouse. And um, Mickey's been doing a lot of crazy things this year with Funko. As you guys already know, Mickey has been establishing himself across the international seas. Um, he has different variants. So, so far we know that um, there is a Thai, Pivity, Thailand mm -hmm. version of Mickey as well as a China, ex is it China exclusive? No, it was Chinese New Year. Or Chinese ex New Year exclusive when Mickey was dressed up as a cool tiger, as well as a genuine, um, I guess, Chinese outfit. I'm not, I'm not too sure what to call it. But lo and behold, you guys, we, the Filipino people, have our own, very own, exclusive Mickey Mouse to the Philippines. And I'm going to show you guys the quirks, the cool little features of this particular Mickey and how he stands out so far amongst the other crowd. All right, so to begin this review, um, right, right here we have is Mickey Mouse. And this is the standard box that Mickey does come in. And what makes him um, so unique is that this particular Mickey has six different variants so you guys you heard me if you want to go ahead and collect this set there are a total of six different mickeys and what makes these mickeys um, so unique and different um, i can go ahead and show you guys right now so as you guys can see uh, right away with the sticker each mickey has their own very unique sticker and these stickers are the six most popular cities in the philippines so the one i have in hand is of course the capital of the Philippines and that would be Manila you guys so as you guys can see what Manila is known for is such a crowded place you know it's such a bustling city and what better way to show Mickey on a jeepney and for those who don't know what a jeepney is it is pretty much like a modified jeep that's been like expanded that could fit about 30 to 40 people and like you're cramped up inside and it's like a really fun experience if you have never experienced a ride in Jeepney before. Are you sure it's fun? <laughs> well, I haven't rode one per se, but from the videos from what I've seen, it, it looks pretty fun to me. So this is the front of the box, the side, the back, 
And you guys, this right here is so amazing. I love how Funko is doing this with all their releases, especially for internationally. They're dressing up Mickey in like traditional outfits. And the one that Mickey is right here, he is wearing a barong. So for those who don't know what barong is, it is pretty much a very silky white see-through t-shirt. And usually the guys are the ones wearing it. So to, to take a closer look at the pop, this is Mickey outside of the box. And of course, you know, you got that cool Mickey stance. And this will be the barong I was telling you guys. It's the clear, silky, white t-shirt. And pretty much we wear this for any formal events. And I just love how the design or design of how this Mickey turned out. And I forgot to mention what's really cool as well with this particular release. I mean, this one right here is so well thought of that um, in the inclusion with each of the different stickers, uh, the backings of each box is also different as well. So I'm about to show you guys what, what I mean by that. So for example, this one right here is the Manila exclusive. And in the backing of this particular box, you have this background, you guys. And I love the design. You have pretty much like... I think it's supposed to be like the little sign on the jimmy. Yeah. But I just love the color combo, the color blocking, the different fonts. It's just a really fun, uh, thought out design. And each one is personally different for each of the Mickeys, which I think is so cool. So if you guys are happy, if you guys are really trying to get this set, um, I highly recommend it because each Mickey is different. For the second Mickey, this is my hometown in the Philippines. This is pretty much where my dad's side of the family is from. And they're from the bustling city of Cebu City. And what Cebu City is known for is their uh, guitar production. And what better way to show that with this cool uh, Cebu sticker with a guitar in it. As well as uh, in the backing of the Mickey Mouse, it is a guitar. So I thought that's really cool. The next Mickey. This particular Mickey is uh, for my peeps in Shargao. Shargao is the uh, surfing capital of the Philippines. So all of my peoples who love going to the beach as well as surfing, I highly recommend you guys visiting Shargao. And I really like about this sticker is if you look carefully, you see Mickey is surfing on a wave. So I think that's like an excellent design for this box. Pretty much all the boxes are pretty much the same except for the sticker and um, the sticker and the backing. For the fourth Mickey, uh, this one right here, you guys, I have been here before. It's by far one of the most beautiful places I, I've ever been to. Um, the water is crystal clear. The beach is just super clean. It's just a really like tourist location where you guys could have fun. Um, for all my people who are 20, 21 up and over, I guys, I can't tell you guys how many bars and parties you guys could go on at this particular occasion. And this will be, of course, the famous Barakai Beach. Um, once again, this particular sticker has a beachfront, which of course is the main attraction for this location. This one right here is really unique because I didn't really know this until Pivdi had told me. But I did not know Baguio City was the capital of strawberries. Or they're very known for their strawberries. Um, I think that's the only place you can go strawberries because it's it's the only place in the Philippines that's cold. A little bit. Just a little bit. A little bit. Because <laughs> me personally, it was hot. Like, I'll be sweating. So... When people told me it was some, there's a place that's cold in the Philippines. I don't know, you guys. I haven't experienced any cold there yet, but uh, this place supposedly is cold with a lot. Colder, of, a little bit colder. A little bit colder. <laughs> Are we talking about two degrees? No, I would say it gets to like, like maybe sixties. Sixties. That's pretty cold for back home, you know. Like our normal is like seventy-five. Because if you're about to tell me eighty, eighty-five, that's no. pretty much hot. Like at that point. <laughs> I mean like summertime mostly, but when it's like the winter time, whatever. Winter time. 
So, so far we have five, and the final one, um, what would, what makes this particular Mickey, this particular last Mickey so unique was that you could not buy him separately. So when Pibbly had went to Big Boys and asked if she could purchase it separately or by itself, they had said that Pibbly would have to buy the entire set for her to get this particular Mickey. Only a certain people were able to get it. I guess like they had like a, a giveaway of a little like a little like mouse ticket, mm -hmm. and you can only claim it if you have that little ticket. So they gave it out on Facebook, I think, or something. So oh. that's the only that's the only way you can buy the Chase version. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I, I just thought that you know like, what makes it said. What will make this set complete is, of course, you would have to get all six Mickeys because um, I have to say the detail and the thoughts behind all of them is really amazing. And the final one is the chase of all Mickeys. So this one right here, guys, is the Serpa version of Mickey. So what makes this Mickey so different from the other Mickeys is if you look closely, Mickey is... Um, Instead of being black and white, he is more of a brown and yellowish hue. It is called what? Some people call it Kayu Mangi. Kayu Mangi. That that's, means. That's our color. That is our color, which is. Brown. Brown. <laughs> <laughs> so I thought that was a really fun touch with this particular Mickey. And, um,. Uh, pretty much I think this Mickey um, on the sticker it's a combination of pretty much like like all the little fun like traits and characteristics of the Philippines so it's Mickey on the Jibney uh, what else he has it's Mickey on the Jibney Mickey wearing traditional outfits and um, of course the street or the license of the Jibneys and of course you get that Second sticker of Big Boy. This lets everyone know that this is the Chase variant of Mickey. And there is in total 5,000 5, units of this particular Chase. So this particular Mickey is limited. And of course the backing is... Uh... Oh, this one here is cool, you guys. It says Mickey Penis. So it Make has it like, it. huh? Make it show it. It has all the cool little like. It says Mickey Filipinas. Man, baby, I cannot speak. Mickey Filipinas. So it has all of like the cool once again, uh, traits and cool like little like um, traits of the Filipino culture, and yeah. So this pretty much uh, completes the whole set of the F Mickey Go Philippines line. I want to go ahead and show you guys this because I think Big Boy did a phenomenal job with this particular release. Um, if you do get this set, you do get these pretty cool exclusive stickers. So, um, of course, we got Big Boy with his chubby self trying to surf. Uh, we got Big Boy enjoying himself fun in the sun. I love his little scuba suit and as well as the coconut. Oh, this one here is my favorite, guys, because this one here is pretty much a sticker for the Cebu people. Once again, we are known for our guitar making as well as our Lichon. I highly recommend you guys if you guys haven't had Lichon, the Cebuano way, best way ever made. So this one's a cool sticker. And we got Big Boy with his fly barong. Ooh, this one here is cool. This one's Big Boy eating uh, strawberries as well as ube jam. You got him driving a Jimmy Hong Kong and of course Big Boy reading a newspaper. So this does come included with this particular Mickey Mouse set. So this does it pop Shivagalu family for this particular video. If you guys like what you saw, please drop a like and comment down below and subscribe to the channel. That way you guys are able to keep with keep up with us on our daily Funko adventures. If you haven't already, if you're a new viewer, please follow us on our social medias. I will go ahead and leave them here at y'all's pleasure. And until next time, I'm your boy Pop Shabaka Do, and I'll see you guys later.